Hi everyone and welcome to our first Dubai vlog. We've just come home, oh, haven't we? So it's been the most amazing trip and you're gonna see two parts of everything we did on this amazing holiday. But before we go into it and show you, if you're new around here, my name's Brogan, this is Benji, my partner, and we went out to Dubai to have a holiday that we booked long time October ago. October yeah. last year. But we didn't think it would happen because the weeks leading up to it were a huge roller coaster. I basically ended up spending 11 days in hospital where they found a tumour in my heart. Quite a scary experience, had loads of scans, did loads of tests, specialists involved, uh, like cardiac specialists. I was lined up to have surgery, um, open heart surgery to remove the tumour but in the end the uh, cardiac surgeons decided that it was best to keep it in there for now to get in there they would have had to damage my heart and it might not have repaired so at the moment it's say more dangerous to try and remove it than it is to keep it in there I might be having surgery in six months I might be having surgery in six years I might be having surgery in 60 years it is literally all dependent on if it grows if it moves and how my general health is um, but of course before we left we asked the doctor and the specialist every question under the sun can I drink can I do sports can I go to the gym can I because the doctor and the specialist knew that we were supposed to be going on holiday yeah that was nearly cancelled but we couldn't cancel it in the end thank goodness <laughs> so we tried we did try cancelling <laughs> yeah. it and it ended up that we got the fit to fly for it you it was a blessing in the end so as there any medical questions we asked him obviously whether he said yes or no it, the big outcome was whether my mother would let me go because <laughs> her opinion is up there uh, higher, so, yeah. um, but no as i said please don't worry we got the all clear mm -hmm. also massive thank you to everyone that supported us on instagram um dms comments just and um, everything is lovely friends family and also a massive thank you to the nhs yeah they were incredible they were it was 11 days it was 11 hard days but they they tried to keep give us all the information they could which is that the, the specialist has never seen a case like this it shouldn't be there there's no reason for it to be there um mm. so yeah it's, just, a, it's a really difficult one to navigate because we couldn't fully explain everything because we also didn't have all day the, to day we didn't know yeah answers. and then when we thought we did know they, just, they changed their mind on yeah. doing the surgery so yeah so if you did follow us on instagram and you saw all of that then we like benji said we just want to say a huge thank you um and so this trip was obviously under crazy circumstances a complete 360 we packed everything in a few hours <laughs> we made the decision and we had that downtime for you to relax and talk about all your options and it was just such an amazing experience to be able to do that and we do recognize how lucky we are to have been able to go so also i know it will probably seem full on because obviously we only really record the clips where we're doing things but in between each clips like we'd do a ride lazy river or mm. we'd go to the shops and we'd do shop 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 let's go and grab a drink like, mm. the boring stuff you won't see because it's us just chilling out taking a breather but we, you, trust me you did a lot of naps <laughs> a, lot of a lot of naps a lot of swimming a lot of relaxing just chilling reading it was really beautiful we had an amazing time I think so it was perfect exactly what we needed yeah. at exactly the right time yeah so we hope you enjoy the vlog please do give it a like and let us know in the comments if you enjoyed it and there'll be another one as well so we split it up in half haven't we mm. there was so much that we did um but yeah just a big thank you to everyone and um yeah enjoy the video <laughs> see you later three hours later and we've got negative tests <laughs> Ooh, material girl <laughs> oh we have fun We're through security successfully. We've just arrived at Yo Sushi. Just thought it'd be a really good option that we could pick a couple of things, nibble at it. It's actually uh, 3.30, 24. Um, so we can't get the information for our gate until seven. So we're just gonna kill time basically. It's been a breeze. Security was really easy. Um, I actually need to put my braces back on. I took them all off before I went through. You're not jangling anymore. I'm not jangling. I need to put them all back on. It's been a really nice experience so far. And we're gonna have a little mooch the shops and we're just so full of gratitude that we're here i just can't even i can't i have no words i feel weirdly very emotional and i won't quite believe it until we're there 
this is happening when I didn't think it was happening. Right, first round is a little bit sushi. I've got the California rolls and Benji has the... Dynamite Dynamite tea. Dynamite <laughs> And I've got a bit of a rogue choice, but I really love these drinks. Are you... the same ones you get at the post office? Yes, I love them. <laughs> Let's eat. I've just been munching on my gyoza and we've got a Korean fried chicken and Benji has a katsu curry. <laughs> Happy boy. All right, this is Heathrow T3 and it is definitely busier than when I was in Gatwick in November. It's very busy, it feels very normal. Um, so we're just gonna pop into a few shops, get the bits we need. We're trying on sunglasses. These are Ted Baker. I thought I wanted Ray-Ban, but I don't own like a really nice pair of sunglasses. And I said to Brogan that she cannot come to Dubai <laughs> With the sun how it is, with £2.50 Primark sunglasses, <laughs> with no UV protection. Okay, I agree. I've been needing mm. nice ones for a while. I like these though. They, they've got them. like a them. different colour down the side. As soon as I saw them, I thought that's your name. Yeah, no, I think these are them, you know. I think so. This is exactly what I had in mind. And I like the fact I can like put them through my hair. That's a big thing for me. Because, obviously, if you have the bits they get stuck in your hair it's super annoying also this is my travel outfit today i'm wearing this pink jumper was in my stitch fix box and it's super super comfortable lululemon leggings my running trainers they are this brand they are so comfortable so and the little bag was also stitch fix my suitcase is away the away luggage that we have now which i'm gonna do a whole video on our suitcases everywhere is very very busy i would recommend booking a lounge if you can we wanted to go into one because I get discounts with my Monzo card, but everywhere's like full and you have to pre-book. So we've tried a lot of the different restaurants. It's so busy because it's now five o'clock. We still have two hours until we can actually go to our gate. So we're queuing in this huge queue to see if we can get into that pub bar. We've been delayed by an hour, so we're playing cards. There's only one thing for it. And we have our second round of drinks, so we're all good here. Here we go, Dubai, gate seven, finally moving. Oh my gosh, this is happening, guys, this is happening. I don't know if you can actually oh, see. Sun lounges over there, look. Do you want a sun lounger? <laughs> Go on then, sit in there. I don't know if you can see, guys, but this plane is absolutely massive. No, you can't appreciate it. It's an Airbus A380. Does that mean anything to anybody? Oh my gosh, it's huge. It's definitely got an upstairs, downstairs sort of vibe. Oh, I love watching them do like all the luggage and stuff. I just love traveling so much. We bought Travel Scrabble, which to be honest, I wish I'd thought of beforehand, but we saw it and we love Scrabble. So, well, we started playing it at Christmas. So I got that in there. My mum gave me one of these masks. Obviously, I've got loads of these ones, and Benji has loads of blue ones. Yeah, this feels quite nice, actually. I feel like I can do a whole flight with this. You can breathe, but you feel like you're, like, covered. You know what I mean? That's always ideal when you can breathe. Very sad, guys. I didn't get a chance to do a pack with me. I'm really, genuinely gutted. I really wanted to, but we packed in, like, three hours, and I literally vlogging was the last thing in my mind. But I promise you, we're going to do loads more trips, so I'll, I'll film the next ones. I've got a space mask. I thought this could be quite nice to put on. Oh, I'm gonna, you've got my toiletries, haven't you? Yeah. You should always pack a boyfriend because they're really good. <laughs> I put Apple Air Tags in both of our suitcases and I can see mine has moved. It was over here a minute ago and it's just moved to here. It's happening. <laughs> We're gonna divide. Also, I can confirm that these masks, they're great. They are, my mum was right. I will link them for you. I've never flown Emirates before. This is my first time. They've just given us a little hand sanitizer and a spare mask. Any mobile phones or tablets should be put into flight mode. We've got beef and potatoes, little potato salad, a salted caramel dessert, all the usual bits, and I've got an apple juice. We can't see out the window, but we can see on the screen. That's so cool. Coming into land, that is absolutely mad. And then there's the plane. How crazy is that? Can't get over this. Wow. My mind is blown. Quick summary of flying with Emirates for the first time. Food was really, really good quality. 
I, I ate all of mine, it was delicious. The cabins are actually pretty spacious for economy. Negrim wise, like, yeah. It was a nice spot. Oh my god. We're through security. What a gorgeous arrival. Beautiful. They quickly scanned our suitcases which is the first that's ever happened to me. Anyway, so we're here, we're four hours ahead. This airport is incredible. I'd never seen photos of it. I had no idea what it was like. Let me try and show you. Look at this. The palm trees and the screens, everything is just luxe. We're staying in the Anantara on the palm. So we'll show you that when we get there. But I just can't believe how beautiful this is. We did actually have a transfer included with our Emirates holidays package but because we had to change things so last minute and we changed the flight and everything, they couldn't put us on a new transfer because it was just too last minute, which is totally understandable. So we are gonna have to sort ourselves out a taxi. Looking forward to getting outside and feeling the heat. It's been a long, long travel day. And just like that, we have all of our suitcases. welcome drink. I don't know what it is but it's absolutely divine. A cold peach ice like tea. Oh it's delicious. So we've checked in. The check-in experience was so lovely. The lady was really nice. We are too early. They're gonna text us when the room's ready. So basically breakfast finishes at 11, it's 22. So we've got 20 minutes to go and get some bits. I think we'll go one at a time because I don't oh, we've got our stuff there. So you go up. Yeah, you have a little look. I feel like I'm happy. I feel like I'm gonna cry because I just can't process that we're here. I feel like I'm having a completely out of body experience. The drive up here was amazing. Like, Everything was so impressive and new and modern and clean and beautiful. I, I've just noticed that there's free magazines over there. Oh my god. So this is the buffet and I need to get my head around these restaurants. So we, in our package, we booked with Emirates Holidays and we got half board included. We've also got a premium lagoon access room that we paid for, which has got a private swim up room my mum recommended this hotel she stayed here before so is my brother and my stepdad just got to get my head around the different restaurants there's three that we need to book um a couple that we can just walk up to actually just while i have this out i thought i'd show you that this is the map and our room is going to be over there so obviously we'll show you when we check in okay so they have a massive pancake section here oh my gosh wow and then this side is where they making things oh my gosh i feel so overwhelmed i don't know where to go i figured i'd get a fresh omelette made in front of me oh there's just so much food i can't keep up there's like a fresh fruit section here i went for an omelette and the little potato rosti things benji had a semi not full english kind of sausage and beans and whatever omelette an omelette yeah and then i picked out some fruit and a little banana bread cake thing so first meal of the holiday Look at you, you happy boy. <laughs> True love is when he goes and gets pancakes for both of us. I would have got the fruit <laughs> and everything, but I didn't know where it was and I panicked. That's okay. Sorry. Is that marshmallows? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I was, I was going for my fruit here, but... <laughs> all right, they're ready for us. We're going in a golf golf buggy. We are ready. We're doing them all. Yeah, I think we're Yeah. 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 What's the name under that name? Yeah. Oh my god. This is where our room is. Okay, room tour. This is obviously the door. We've got a big full length mirror. This I think is an interconnecting room or yeah. so as if you're like we've got friends just No but there's no friends. we're on the end, aren't we? No. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah, no, there is end but one. End but one. Okay. And um, 13, so that's fine. Okay. <laughs> that's good. Okay. First of all, on the left, we'll do the bathroom. So it is ginormous. Everything is big. <laughs> if I remember rightly, oh, look at your look on your right. <gasps> oh my gosh, there's a big bath. Oh. <gasps> oh, how nice. Well, 
I didn't know that. Oh my gosh, that's lovely. And when I walked in and I saw these doors, I was like, <gasps> So this is the bathroom then. So we've got LMS products there. We have separate doors for the shower and toilet. Proper rainfall, nice big shower. LMS products in there. It's huge in there, isn't it? Yeah. And then toilet. I love this. How nice is this? It's all separate. Yeah, and it's all in I there, mean, massive. A toilet and a foot spa. <laughs> How good is this? And look. Uh, it's you a bit can be in the bedroom he's, he's and we can joking. Chat to each other while no. <laughs> wow, this is stunning, isn't it? Yeah, so that's the bathroom. I feel like I shouldn't be here. I feel like we've won the lottery genuinely. I, like <laughs> I feel like what are we doing? Okay, and then our bedroom. So I'm assuming this is a wardrobe. Let me just have a little look quickly in here. Not very excited. Oh, lights up. Oh, lovely. I love stuff like this. I'm gonna put all my bits in. Okay, good, good, good. Loads of storage. Space to put luggage. <laughs> it's huge. The bedroom's huge. So here's the bed. That's over six foot long. Yeah, that is that is a big bed. And then huge TV. What? I just thought that was decoration. Oh my god. Glass, champagne glasses. Wow. Little fridge. We've got what's this? Chargeable. Refer to minibar price list. Okay. I might use these drawers for my makeup and hair stuff actually. I'm gonna take everything out of there. We it's can put UK laptops plugs. and stuff it's in there. Well, yeah, so good. And then should we go outside then I assume? Oh Benj, they've already put towels out on the bed. Oh my god. <laughs> this is incredible. Listen. <laughs> Wow, this is just breathtaking, isn't it? This is absolutely dreamy. Oh my God, I can't believe we have our own little steps. This is insane. Bench, look, we can even just chill on that bit there with a book and a drink. And look, we get the sun in the afternoon. So it's one o'clock now, is it? Yeah, one o'clock and we've got sun here. So that's good. It is beautiful. It is so beautiful. It's absolutely everything we wanted. <laughs> Really oh. <laughs> it's a bit different to the CCU ward from 72 I hours know. ago. I know. It's a very different holiday than we've ever so done that, before. In, so in three nights, sorry, four nights, slept in the hospital, slept in my own bed for one night, slept on a plane, well I didn't sleep on a plane, and now here. Yeah, that's, you're not wrong. We got an incredible deal on it as well. Like. I know we keep on saying right, it's really fun, but it's we did get a good deal because we, got we booked an it when deal Omicron on it. was like uh, yeah. Well, we're basically st still we just come off the red list, didn't we? I'm gonna take some quick photos and video for real, and then you bet we are diving we'll straight, straight in the water. Okay, good. Okay, good. Okay. Right, we've unpacked everything. We have sun creamed up. You don't have to be in this bit. I had to shave my chest, but a drink every time he brings it up because for my surgery. And it's not me. Like, I, I've always had a hairy chest, hairy arms, hairy legs. And That's it's... fine. We don't have to film your chest. No, I don't. It is. It's just funny seeing it. Honestly, I think it looks fine, but he's just not used to it. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna get in the water now for the first time. I'm We've just gonna leave the camera so here. So much suntan lotion on. Yeah, but we don't want to burn. Oh no, yeah, that wasn't a negative. <laughs> that was a. We're, we're... Well, we have to. Yeah. I wasn't gonna vlog, but I just thought I'd let you know that we went for a lovely swim. It was divine. We just left all the cameras, phones, everything, and we just swam and Benji's grin on his face. It was just the best. It was just the best. We had our sunnies on. We just felt that sweet, sweet sunshine, just didn't we? Bobbing. And then we both fell asleep on the sun loungers for like 15 <laughs> minutes outside. So warm, we dried so quick. A little power nap. And then I just had a shower and I uh, ate a mini thing of Pringles. Because of course. Because it's holiday. If you're not sat on your bed with the windows closed, <laughs> eating English snacks, like are you really on holiday? Tell us if you can relate. It seems like different rooms obviously get different sunshine different times of day. We've got a lovely spot here. Yeah. It's really, it's just dreamy. Honestly, we're so happy. But we're going for dinner in a bit. So what time actually? It's four o'clock now, half four. And we're going for dinner at six. Oh my God, we were just about to leave for dinner. Hello. And we noticed the cocktail man. He's gonna make us a pina colada. Yeah, it'd be much more of a vibe if we were in the pool. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. 
This is an experience, isn't it? You're gonna have to get in. <laughs> Thank you very much. Have a good evening. That's the first time that's happened for us, so cheers to the first night of our holiday. Pina colada. So I just text the boys then. Did I need a pina colada from a man in a boat? No. <laughs> Am I gonna get one? Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cheers. Oh, it's actually delicious. All oh, that hits good, done now. <laughs> good soup. This is my outfit. I love it. Love it, it looks really good on you. This is not a dress I'd normally wear, but Benji said he loved it when I tried it on. And it's actually from one of my Stitch Fix boxes. Yeah. Um, and yeah, just nude accessories. I'm going to have a little, like, I might wear my scarf actually, just around my shoulders. And the most important accessory in your right hand. Cheers. Benji's outfit of the day. Oh, that was it. <laughs> <laughs> right, we've just come down to the beach house, which looks like this. We've got a booking at six. Six o'clock, which is a bit early, but that's all they had today. So we normally eat at like seven, eight o'clock, wouldn't we? Oh yeah, lovely. Okay, this is just getting better and better. It's just, it's just insane. Look at this. This is stunning, isn't it? So this chef is a three-time world pizza champion and Guinness World Record holder, and he is having his last evening here tonight. So I think I want to try one of his pizzas. I'm thinking maybe the grilled pear one that sounds nice. pretty good. Pear. Basically, yeah, cheese and pear. And then are you gonna have a burger? I think so. I was going to have pizza, obviously, because of Daniela, but I saw someone's burger walk past her. It looked amazing. Was... We can't eat here again. Yeah, there's loads of stuff on the menu. And look at this sun. Like, incredible. Oh my gosh, look at that sunset now. It's not real, is it? It's, it's like beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. I can't believe this is where we're having dinner. This is just insane. It no, it doesn't. It still doesn't feel real. You okay? Yeah. Just soaking it up. Yeah. It doesn't do justice on camera, but it is it's ginormous. Massive. I've never seen the sun like that big oh, before. Oh, hang on, let me pan over. There it is. So for our starter, we've got buffalo mozzarella and tomato. So nice and light and easy, but we, we didn't actually want a starter, but he said it was included, so we went for one. And the sun is now completely gone, just like that. Got like sandy toes. We took some photos <laughs> down on the beach. But this looks delicious. And we've got some bread and the music's nice and it's just dreamy. This is maybe the best date night ever. <laughs> All right, Benji's gone for the burger and chips, and I went for a pizza that has mozzarella and pear on it. I saw someone walk past from it, and I was like, I'm not, I've got And this lighting's lovely now with the fairy lights. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it on the camera. Over that way, yeah, it's crazy. Look at the view. We finished our mains. <laughs> We've got our desserts now. I've got a tiramisu. Benji's got raspberry sorbet. A bit jealous actually, but that's nice and refreshing. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Ice cream colours it. Sorbet. Mm. Well, that's delicious. Finished our meal and there is a fire show starting. Are you ready to see fire show? Oh. Please clap your hands. Oh. <laughs> We're just walking back and look how beautiful it is all lit up at night. All the lights in the pool. I what you are now? Huh? What now? Yeah. Oh he's he's a rebel we can swim, he is. We can swim whenever we like, so. Yeah, true. Obviously you've got to wait half an hour for the food to go down. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise as my big, mum says, big rule. you will definitely one hundred percent drown and die. <laughs> <laughs> that's 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 like mother's law, isn't it? It's true. I like to be in at the beach house. I liked yeah. the little fire show. I loved watching the sunset. It was a really lovely first meal. Yeah. If you if you come if you if anyone ever comes here, have a look when the sunset times are and try and book around then. Because yeah. the view is just like it was lovely. Watching that sun, that was huge, wasn't yeah. it? They've just come in and they've done like a turn down service, so they've put the where have they put the cushions then that we were lying on earlier? Oh, no. oh. <laughs> I don't know where they've put them, but they've laid out a lot of our... Chocolate and Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, didn't expect that. Did not expect that. I didn't know they came in and I've been turned down lots that. of times in hotel rooms, but I didn't realise it was doing like this. <laughs> they've even put slippers by the bed. <laughs> that's so cute. I've been, I've been in hotel rooms 
like little tiny things like that. We, people get people yeah. Like, I am going to move all of these bits of paperwork we were given though. All right, well, we're going to go for a swim and then... Uh, oh, no, yeah? yeah? Okay, I'm coming. We're going to go for a swim and then we'll see them tomorrow. Adios. Hello, everyone. <laughs> It's the next day and this morning we hung out in the room by the pool, we had a lovely breakfast and then we went to the Emirates Mall. So there are two malls, uh, the main ones, the Emirates Mall and the Dubai Mall. The Dubai Mall is meant to be massive and we're going to go there when we do the Burj Khalifa later this week. But the Emirates Mall is also beautiful and we had a really great time there. So. You're, I'm going to show you next. I forgot to intro it this morning, but you're going to see us going to the mall. We go to the Cheesecake Factory and we just had the greatest time. So let's go shopping. There are two major malls. This one, this one's a little bit smaller, but the other one that we really want to go to is the Dubai Mall. This, that's the one that's massive. This is the one that has the ski center in it. Is it? Yeah. Oh, we're obviously not going skiing here. Okay, uh, I totally underestimated the size of this mall. It is ginormous. We have walked so far and <laughs> we're still going and i've just spotted bath and body Works, so obviously we're going in here so we can actually get it in the uk now and i did a whole ad for next beauty and i love this range the cherry blossom but as i'm in store oh here we go he loves candles <laughs> black cherry merlot oh that's delicious yeah this is just such a beautiful shop hang on i like these little anti-back holders oh okay yeah we were definitely uh underestimating the size of this it is absolutely huge and um, we've done our first bit of damage in Bath and Body Works <laughs> do a little haul later so the mall is so big that we found one of these little digital maps and we've just searched ski Dubai you click on it it tells you where you are and then the map tells you to go down the floor and then the next floor down where to go that's so clever okay we're at the end of the mall downstairs and this is where ski Dubai is and we have heard well, I've heard about this for years because obviously I ski and people did say to us, oh, you should try, you should go, but it just doesn't feel right to be on a hot holiday and go skiing, but apparently it's meant to be amazing. Oh my God, Benji, it's so cool. Snow bumper. Oh my gosh, oh, look at the chairlift. No, no, it's no. And I've got to step back, look at the chairlift, it's huge. We're going to Cheesecake Factory for lunch. I don't know they serve, I just want to watch the skiing. <laughs> Um, do you want to get a menu? See a menu? Okay, yeah. I think he's going to like it in here. I don't think. Have you ever eaten in Cheesecake Factory? Oh. It is really nice in here. They've got this massive open kitchen. All of the tables are like big private booths. Yeah. I like hearing all the hubbub from the kitchen yeah. and the, the plates clack, clacking. And... So we can see them through the net, and then to the other side, we can see the ski Dubai. It's we, I, thought, I thought it was massive, but it goes up and around the corner as well. It's huge. Look how beautiful it is in here. It reminds me of Vegas. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Really, really nice. But the menu is absolutely massive. There is definitely something for everyone. Burgers, pastas, salads. But I think we're going to go for chicken sandwiches. Chicken ham. And then uh, strawberry lemonade. And then we'll get some cheesecake. What a good day. These lemonades are massive. <laughs> and we've got some bread and butter as well. Little baguettes. The lighting's not fabulous in here, but hopefully you can see how amazing this looks. It's got like tomato sauce. It's almost like a little mini pizza, chicken pizza style. A bit of pesto maybe. That, that is amazing. You happy? Oh my gosh, it's so good. <laughs> it's so, like the bread's nice, the flavors, the chicken. Just take that for the win. <laughs> If you watch our Florida vlogs, you know how much we love the strawberry acai, acai? at Starbucks. Anyway, it's divine, and this is so similar. It's basically, it's, well, it's, it's, it's like the same thing. It is incredible. It tastes exactly identical, yeah. And it was amazing, and it was huge. And that sandwich was absolutely incredible. Like, so good. We're both so full up, but it'd be rude not to have cheesecake. So, 100% could have shared, shared one. Wish we had thought of that. Didn't really cross our minds. But we're gonna get a cheesecake to take away. And then we're gonna carry on mooch around the mall because there's just so many shops here that we love. And then this afternoon we'll be back in our room and doing a little bit of afternoon sunbathing and reading our books. And then we have dinner tonight at eight o'clock. Right, we've got our cheesecake to go. We'll, we'll show you that later, but just thought I'd show you the ones in the case. I went for this, the cinnamon cinnamon bun. 
Cinnabon one, and then you went for the Dolce Caramel one. It was £55 in total, 270 dirham. Oh, there's Cinnabon opposite, and they have Tim Hortons here as well. Honestly, they have everything here. It's giving me very Florida Mall vibes, you know? Well, especially being like this an American restaurant, obviously, but you just have everything you can need here. So we just wanted to get some Pepsi Max to take back to our room, and we've just found this supermarket on the ground floor. Guys, it's ginormous. Like, it's absolutely ginormous. It's like a huge target inside. That supermarket was incredible there was like brand branding around the, the product or the shelves the aisles of brand like so pepsi had its all its own pepsi its own branding. Uh, yeah red bull had its all its own red bull branding if you loved your cooking and you lived in dubai yeah so easy to get everything because they had we, the cater yeah. for and good quality everything was as well yeah. like ugh, and the food today was amazing also that mall was immaculate we can sell a few to immaculate everyone was very like friendly but like not pushy in the shops and things it was just really the service was lovely mm. everywhere we went like when before we came to dubai everyone was like everyone says you've got to go to dubai and we're like oh okay but i i get i get, you it. get it now i do get it all right these are the cheesecakes they did uh wobble over in transit a little bit but we just thought we'd try them. We've been for a little swim. We've played catch. <laughs> you okay, hon? This is so, so nice. Love it. Absolutely love it. Peaceful now as well. I thought I'd quickly show you what we got in Bath and Body Works today. Woo! The black cherry merlot candle and because it was a deal uh, to buy two we had two of them and then we also got it in a hand wash hand soap foaming one and then we also got anti backs so Benji went for peach bellini and I got ocean and I also got a little pouch to put it in so I can clip it on my bags and it was buy one get one free so I also got this one for free, which is like a wearable lanyard, which could be good if I go on any cruises. Didn't get any clothes. I didn't buy anything else, I don't think. I got a couple of t-shirts in there. You did, from Rip Curl. Mm -hmm. We're going to Bushman's, which is an Australian steakhouse restaurant tonight. Drinks are included with breakfast, but not with any lunches or dinners. Yeah, we're just gonna enjoy our dinner. We, last night at the Boathouse, they get let us have starter main and dessert. So yeah, that's generous. <laughs> I'm really excited to have three courses because we can. This is my outfit of the evening. Just got a little play suit on that I bought for a wedding last year and it's nice and light and cool and comfortable. And I've got little sparkly sandals on and I've just put my hair up in a big grip because we're going to the water park tomorrow, the Atlantis. <laughs> I wanted to go there for so long. And so I didn't see the point in washing, drying, straightening my hair because, well, it's getting wet in the morning at the water park. so. Just clipped it up out my face. Um, and yeah, ready for dinner. We're going to Bushman's, so let's go. So this is the front of the hotel, and this is the restaurant. I'm very excited. This is what the restaurant looks like. Australia is 6,289 miles away. Oh, <laughs> this is my hot date. <laughs> <laughs> it's so pretty in here, I love it. Oh, oh. Finish getting <laughs> right, we've got some bread and butter to start, although we do have starters, but we don't say no to bread and butter, do we? <laughs> we've ordered cocktails. This is a candy floss? Candy crush. <laughs> candy floss. <laughs> so I'm really tired. Yeah? Okay, I'm excited. Fruity, coconutty, nice. Oh, okay. Hang on. It doesn't taste anything like it looks. Okay, all right. Let me try. It's really fresh. It's good, isn't it? Mm. It's kind of like hit a pina colada. Yeah. But and then like with fruit, fruity. Mm. That is a treat. Love it. That's a holiday drink, right? Benji went for the tomato soup, and I've got chicken and cheddar croquettes with lettuce. Ooh. Wow, which one should, which one do you recommend I have? I love this one. I love I'll have that one then. Thank you. I, I wish you could take it home. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Wow. It actually says medium here. Does yours say medium? Ah, oh, rare. 
Oh, it actually says medium rare. I don't know what that is, but it does. And then we've got chips. And I've got peppercorn sauce, and you've got bananas. Bana bana I've never had before. Neither have I. Let's eat. Babe, verdict on dinner. Wow. That was pretty incredible. Like, it was so tender that it didn't even, like, it wasn't even, like, a steaky texture. It, it was, was amazing. So, oh, it was amazing. Good 9 out of 10 from oh, us. Good 9 out of 10. The cocktail was good as well. The cocktail was good. The only thing is, we were too full for pudding. Oh, no. It's very sad, oh, no, but we've got to sit and let it go down. I would have had lime creme brulee, but... Too full. We, we have had cheesecake today. We have had a heavy day of food, to be fair. But, guess what we're going to do now? Go for a little swim swim. Swim in the pool. <laughs> And then we're going to get into bed. And also, I wanted to add, this bed is absolutely ginormous. So Benji is six foot three. So, no, you need to go into it into the bed like a normal person. I can sit into yeah, it normal. Sure, no, it's, it's normal, though. Yeah, but like how big, big it is. Like when you're lying down. Okay, right, you're right on the edge. But you could fit four people in there. Not that you would, but you know. <laughs> the bed is not two beds pushed together, which we often find when we go to uh, hotels, and the, we always fall down the middle, but it's beautiful, the bed linen's lovely. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna get in the pool now, so I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, it's Monday, and I just thought I'd bring you outside, so you can listen to the birds. Oh my gosh, it's so lovely. Benji's just doing his sun cream, and I'm wearing a really cute uh, holiday dress today that I bought in Sainsbury's in 2019 no 2020 before our Caribbean cruise um so yeah it's all got like holiday things on it you know I'm wearing a swimming cosy because we're going to Aquaventure at the Atlantis which is a water park Benji and I love water parks love them our favorites are Siam Park in Tenerife Volcano Bay in Florida and then maybe Typhoon Lagoon at Disney. But I'm pretty confident that this one may swoop in in our top three today because it looks so good. We really want to do Wild Wadi as well, but we'll see how we get on. But oh, I just feel so happy to be here. I'm at that point where I'm like, oh my gosh, I don't want it to go fast. I just want things to slow down and just enjoy each day. But it's only Monday. We've got the whole rest of the week. So um, yeah, I'm just so happy. Let's go to the water park. So we're just walking past the main pool and just thought I'd show you a bit um, because we're obviously not going to be swimming in here very often as we have our own pool. We can come here for cocktails if we want and smoothies and well they do sliders and beers. And just got an egg benedict today which looks so good. I can't believe they actually do that here. It's so good. So I'm pretty sure that the hotel would be able to get us a, um, a, a taxi but I'm using an app called, uh, what's this called, Clavering. All right, our uh, taxi just dropped us off here, right at the front of the Atlantis. We want to go to the water park. We're going to go to the Lost Chambers Aquarium later. This is incredible, isn't it? Yeah, so Vegas. So Vegas. How cool. Oh, it's a Bath and Body Works again. Oh, wow. Good job we haven't got one in ours, isn't it? <laughs> We would have been buying things daily. No money left to go out and do water parks. Here's the entrance. This is so cool. We're just getting our wristbands because we've already booked it through the app. Get your guide, so nice and easy. Also, we have one more here in Atlas Village. Locker room changing and showers as well. There. Okay, thank you. So you can choose where you want to Are these quieter over here? Uh, if you go here, it's a crowded area also, uh, but it's middle in the park. So if you use here, if you anywhere in the Wherever park, we go, it's easier yes. to get there. Yeah. Okay. So you can okay. choose first. Yeah. Okay. So the tickets that I pre-booked in advance a couple of days ago were fifty-five pound each on Get Your Guide, and then as we checked in, we decided to upgrade to the express pass. You guys know we love to do this, especially when we go to water parks, especially when it's half term. Also, because so, we can't just, we can't queue up in the heat. It's too hot for us. Yeah. So we need to just be getting in the water. So two express passes plus a small locker, which you can't share, so it has to be either the men's or the women's, was £114 extra. So definitely pricey side of things, but um, that's the sort of price we pay in Florida too. Look at that, Shark Lagoon. Oh, this is so cool. I love it. It's I very much like Volcano Bay yes, in Universal. Yeah, I was just about to disagree with you then. But yeah, no, yeah, I understand. Got Lazy River. And then Siam Park as well, where you go through the like, aquarium Tunnel. shark tank thingy on the, on the big slide. Yeah. 
I haven't done much, re much research, so I don't know which rides are like the ones to do, but I know they oh, shoot you up, look like that. You can go up. Oh my God. This is so cool. They let you take GoPros if they're attached to your arm, which mine you is. A wrist strap. Yeah. Tower of Poseidon. Is that this? I'm nervous because I don't know what I'm walking into here. Oh my god. The theming. Um, guys, what the heck is that? Okay, so we've got these slide things, Trident Tower. We want to try and go in that turquoisey one. me up. <laughs> Make sure it was snuggy all good. Snuggy all good. <laughs> Put the boobies in. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> this is your kind of a good day out, isn't it? You love a lazy river. <laughs> We haven't done the shark tank yet, so we definitely want to try and get that in. But other than that, it's been really fun so far. I've loved it. Yeah, the sun's out. Um, it's very big, like everything's very spread out. So you have to walk quite far to get to like different sections There's of like the park. There's three main zones, isn't there? With mm. Three towers that have that like, almost ride zone. Yeah, in each tower there's like loads of different rides. I don't know, some people might just be happy doing lazy rivers and then go in from sun lounge and sun lounge or whatever. We did the rapids as well, they were good. Mm. Yeah, it's been good so far. So we're probably going to spend another couple of hours here getting the, done the rides that we haven't done yet. And then we have access to go and see the aquarium inside as well. Um, that's what we're up to. Big aquarium! Through there. We haven't done any of this side yet. The surge and shark attack. We're about to do shark attack. We have no idea what we're getting ourselves into every time we join a nope. different ride. Not a clue. But it looks popular, so, you know, let's go. It is, what 
time, half three-ish. Yeah. And we're calling it a day. We want to have showers. We're pretty much on every ride. All changed And rooms. quite a few of them twice. Yeah. Um, well, so. but actually, Benji's already changed, but there weren't any showers in my locker, so I'm going to go in here. Yeah? Here we go, perfect. They have private showers, which is very nice because I want to wash my hair. It's been such a fun day, but I wanted to have a proper shower because we're going to go to the aquarium and I want to take some nice pictures in there and I feel messy. Yeah, we can wash this hair. Um, cool, all right, I'll be back in a minute. Stopped at this little gelato spot and I've got cookies and cream and Benji's got salted caramel, but they also have uh, sushi bowls and they've got uh, snow cones and all sorts around here. Oh, they've even got Belgian fries. All right, we are leaving the water park and we're going to the Dubai's largest aquarium. Oh yeah. Wow, look at this. Oh my gosh, this is so beautiful. Oh, I cannot wait to go into the aquarium. And we booked a ticket that was for both the water park and the aquarium, so that's good. It only probably takes about 20 minutes to go around, so don't expect it to be massive. But yeah. The main tank is incredible. Yeah, it was, it was good. Lots of beautiful fish. Every time I see on Instagram, it's people standing in here, but I don't think we're gonna get a photo. <laughs> so that bit of the aquarium, it's not actually in the aquarium. This is gonna sound crazy, but this is just in the hotel. So you don't necessarily need to buy a ticket to go into the aquarium because they have it here. If you've done the aquarium in the water park, you'll come out, you'll finish down there. So come out, turn right, turn right again, and you'll come to this little lobby there. Yeah, which is where the massive glass is, basically. It's much bigger there than it is actually in the and aquarium. We got the whole thing to ourselves for like two minutes. It was so full, and then all of a sudden it was... <laughs> Burns on my knee, I was sliding around the floors on my knee, trying to go down, up, left, right, up. My Instagram husband. <laughs> he did a very good job. Now I'm going to sit and edit them for like an hour. Yeah, you've got about a thousand photos from just that one wall. It was so fun though, I got to watch all the fish. Yeah. Thank you babe, it was great. It good. It's now five o'clock, we have dinner at seven, so ideally we need to start oh, making our way back. Yeah. Um, so that we can get ready for dinner. But it's been so much fun here, I really loved hanging out here yeah. today. Ah, good. This is my evening outfit to go to, what's the restaurant called, Benj? Mekong, Mekong. Mekong, Mekong. I think it's the named after the river oh. in Thailand. Oh, well, obviously it's a Thai restaurant. This is my outfit. I got this dress in the sale from River Island and it's nice and floaty. Little black heels, black belt and a little black bag. And I've got my little Tiffany necklace on that Benji bought me for my birthday last year. Your outfit of the day, you look nice. I thought they were black socks for a minute. You haven't done your shoes up. No. Tommy shoes, welcome shorts, Tommy top. Thank you. Wow. Look at my hot date. <laughs> Every day. <laughs> we're in these really cute little tuk tucks. let me just show you look no one's out here because i don't know if people think it's chilly but it's not cold at all it's really pretty the menu was amazing we should have got a clip of the menu they had thai vietnamese and i think there was some chinese options, options in there as yeah. well here we have beetle leaves mm -hmm. uh, roasted uh, coconut roasted nut uh, onion lime and ginger and this one is Thai chili mm -hmm. uh, with the palm sugar sauce. Cool. So what you have to do just mix all together inside of the bitter leaves, just roll it wow. and it all together. Wow, thank you. Thank you. And just going straight in, we've never done this before. Oh, no, beetle leaf. So you put everything in. Yeah, cheers. Cheers. Yeah, good. 
We went for a sharing platter for our starter. So we've got mahi mahi fish fingers, spring onion, uh, spring roll, sorry, chicken satay. What are these little prawn things? Toast. Oh yeah. It's a prawn toast and then sun dried beef. Wow. With the, on, we have so many that we couldn't decide, so we were like, oh, Let's just get them all. And on the first thing at the top at the next page was the sharing platter. Right? Yeah. That one. <laughs> no wow. That's amazing. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I went for sweet and sour chicken and Benji went for a chicken red Thai curry. <laughs> Them words, we're just jumbling back around. Red, the Thai red curry. Thai <laughs> red curry. Sorry. Chicken, chicken Thai red curry. <laughs> Thank you very Look much. Look at these. <laughs> Enjoy. Thank you so much. I went for the banana and caramel tart for dessert. And Benji's got the creme brulee. Passion fruit and ma mango. Mango. Fruit. Yeah. I think I might have to try a little bit of that, I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I concur. <laughs> Good morning. It's Tuesday and it's beautiful outside. Look at this. So the sun is just coming around. It's 11 a.m. almost, and we had the most amazing lion this morning. We'll go for buffet lunch today, probably. See what that's like. And then this evening we're going to a Thai restaurant. I'll show you when we get there. Um, off of the hotel. It's at the Jemima Hotel, I want to say. We've been sunbathing. It's been so lovely. I've read a couple of chapters in my book. Um, but because we missed breakfast, we're going to go for an early lunch, so it's only half twelve. And I've just chucked on this plain white tea and these little shorts were from M&S and my Javianas. Alright, so we're having our lunch and I've gone for a little bit of salad, pizza and this is a fish burrito which looks amazing. Look at that! Made in front of us, so good. I'm not being funny, this looks like a dessert I would get in like a proper restaurant. This man here just made it up for me fresh in front of me it like like what you'd get at the ritz after having like scones and cream doesn't it it's incredible like just look at that benji's just having curry well, butter <laughs> chicken but like proper proper, proper nice lovely. i just can't believe this is my pudding it's delicious back from lunch that was so good so so yummy those fish burritos were nine out of ten i'm gonna sit outside on our little sun lounges oh It is 2.22 on the 22nd of the 2nd, 2022. How's your little setup here? All good? Yeah, good. I am reading my book. I'm going to go for a swimming and then I'm dry now. Yeah, you have to keep dipping in and getting back out. Yeah, yeah. This is not the best full length mirror and lighting, but I'm wearing the most beautiful dress. I think I'll try and get Bench to show you again when we get down to the restaurant area. But this was actually a very lovely gift from phase eight and it would make a perfect um, dress for a wedding. In fact, I think I might wear it to a wedding we've got later this year. It came with the little belt. I think it looks really nice with all the pleats. Just like perfect evening in Dubai dress. Brown got my, jacket. thank you. You look nice too. Thanks. Look at your little outfit. Very suave, you look very like Bond-like. Like you're, you know like Bond in, when he's in like Spain or France or somewhere in Europe, you look like that. Ginger Bond. Ginger Bond, babe. Oh, he's not allowed to get outside for one and a half an hour and it's about 50. Ding, 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 
arrived on the other side where Pai Tai is and this place is incredible. Like, this looks like its own little village, like on a mountain. It is incredible. I would stay, I think I'd stay here if we didn't stay at Anantara again. I think I'd like to stay here. We should We're right by the Burj Al Arab as well. Mm -hmm. And so that's next to Wadi Wadi, uh, Wild Wadi. Look at where we're sat. This is so beautiful. So this is the menu. They have a tasting menu where you can get everything or they have their mains. I haven't properly looked yet, but I just thought I'd quickly show you so you can pause it and read anything if you're interested. Wok fried dishes, curries, rice and noodles. And then desserts, cool, okay. an amazing meal wasn't it yeah i really enjoyed that oh look at it it's Just so the whole, beautiful like, vibe of the the boat and the, or the ab abra i think they call it it was beautiful and now we have a private one back it's one of those meals that you sort of only do once you probably we will probably wouldn't do it ever again it was one of those special date night lovely lovely meals now we're doing something quite fun we're going to go to the point fountain show there are two major fountain shows in dubai the point runs for three minutes every 30 minutes and then the dubai um where the burj uh, khalifa is there's another fountain show there is this it no. okay i was gonna say no. i thought I was, is this it no okay we've just come upstairs to look at the view of the burj al arab it's gorgeous isn't it it's lovely that's where we were just down there wow beautiful all right so we've arrived down at the point which is a hotel i think by the looks of it i just thought it was an area yes yeah, so did i but i think it's a hotel and we're going to try and find where to see the show and we're just going to make the half past eight i think we've got like three minutes wherever these people are walking to i reckon that's where to go look how beautiful it is down here this is absolutely amazing and if i spin over this side we've got the atlantis there Wow, this feels very like Vegas to me. This is so cool, and then the show's gonna be right here, which is fun. Lovely. Why is my nose red? I caught the sun. Don't need to. It was only three minutes long, but it was nice. The song was sweet. The lights were nice. Everyone keeps telling us the the other one's better. So I think we'll they do different that. shows as well. It says that you can vote for what show you want on Wednesday at eight o'clock. Loads of restaurants all around as well. So if you wanted to come down and have dinner, you could watch the couple of shows probably while you're watching. Yeah, we're eating. Every half an hour it goes off. So obviously that's the size of the Atlantis yeah. Hotel. And the size of the water parks, it starts here. It goes all the way across Atlantis, yeah, water park, yeah, and then finishes there. It's like twice the size of the actual <laughs> yeah, hotel. Yeah, but I will say it looks huge, and it was huge to walk around. But it wasn't actually like slides-wise. It was quite a lot of walking between yeah. the towers. So like it was three quite main spread towers, out. and that's where all those things are. But yeah. in between, you've got a good like five-minute walk between each tower, and you can do what we did, and we just used the lazy river as a little taxi service around the park, didn't we? What you can do, you can just hop up, hop on and off the lazy river. But I will say we put, and uh, we didn't say yesterday, but we put Aqua Venture just below Universal's Volcano Bay. Yeah, well, it didn't quite match Cyan it. Cyan Park top still, isn't it? Cyan Park still our number one water park of the ones we've done. But we are going to try Wild Body tomorrow. We know it's a bit smaller, but you'll see that in the next vlog. I think that's all right though. If you know you're only going there for half a day, it means that we can pop 
potter around a few of the things around mm. there as well so yeah we've got a fun day tomorrow so yeah. we're gonna end the vlog here it's been a really lovely half of the week so far really good day we've it's done loads of good by, things it? it has there's just so much to do in dubai and we are aware obviously that the expo is on right now as we're here we're not going to have a chance to do any of if that if we were here for longer or if we'd already been once and tried all the things for the first time yeah but this is our plotting out areas and exploring kind of time isn't it yeah it's been amazing so do make sure you subscribe and watch our part two and yeah thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again in the next one see you later bye <laughs>